Hello there, President University YouTube watchers and also on all the other media platforms. This link will be there to see this video. But I am here, uh, Navin Chauri, very, very happy because Prudentia was one of the best uh, event that went on from the, uh, the, the marketing department and the MBA department that we are talking here. And uh, Ms. Nisha is always there uh, supporting us and also doing the event on her own. It was fantastic, Nisha. I thought it was, a, uh, of course, it was a, a record that 300 plus participants participated in the online 314 event 314 she says there we go uh, but uh, it has gone international also yes. my god president's university is going international so please give us few details on how did it go international <laughs> you know actually we didn't put in any effort and it was a national event so we didn't think that registration would be done uh, when i was going through the excel sheet i saw that we have got a participant from abu dhabi although he is currently studying in india but he is from abu dhabi yeah. and we got one participant from bangladesh right he is a bangladeshi and he participated in the beatboxing event my god so uh, and when i was analyzing making a report on the event i saw that we have got participants from 24 states wow bravo super when we started we didn't think it would be such a success yes great. yes great that's how great, great that's how great things happen in presence university we yes. don't think that's going to be great but it'll be great <laughs> <laughs> god bless <laughs> right so after the event now the whole motto and the purpose of this video is why have uh, uh, we sat here is because to give the uh, a kind of a memory because all the uh, certificates and all the prizes of course it will all be valid but this video will make sure you keep these videos as your memory you can show it anywhere you want to on your library on your social media platforms you can also keep this as your part of your resume also this link and all that isn't it Nisha? it is a publicity it is a publicity yes. for them also yes yes this would be giving them a leverage yeah. what of their talent definitely Good. and now we have uh, uh, miss meera with yes, us. Sir. hi meera hello how sir. are you, meera? you, how are you? Say hi to the camera by just putting hi everyone up. hi super how are you guys right so meera uh, of course, you have the mic there along with you, but I will also be trying and uh, talking about the winner's name here. But yes, uh, first of all, what was the first event that happened on Prudentia and who was the winners of that first event winners? Well, the first event we have here is Stand Up Comedy and the person who won first prize for Stand Up Comedy was Likhit Ravi from Christ University, Bangalore. Super. So that was Likhit Ravi. Yeah. We have got only one uh, uh, part, uh, winner for stand-up comedy. There are a few events where we have got only single winners uh, yeah. as far as the number of entries. And wherever the entries were more, we gave them three positions. Wow. So Super. for stand-up comedy, we have got one winner. Right. But for just a minute, we've got all three. Right. So what Nisha is trying to say is it's easy to talk like me, not to do comedy. That's why just one winner for stand-up comedy because comedy <laughs> is very, very tough. <laughs> right. So let's go right. to just a minute. So the next event is just a minute. And the person who won first prize for just a minute was Aravindo from Presidency College. Wow, there we go. One of our, our own prodigy, Aravindo. There we go. Here is this video. Now the topic given to me is what would I do if I was PM for a day? So speaking about being the PM for a day, it reminds me of Anil Kapoor's film Nayak. Uh, I guess the only common factor between me and Anil Kapoor right now probably would be the hair, nothing else. Jokes apart, uh, it would definitely be an honor to experience that particular power and that seat. That's for sure. Because we, it's easy for us to hurl out abuses or uh, pretend to be armchair critics when you look at the prime minister or his function or be it any person sitting in that particular chair. But only when you go and sit there and feel the heat and feel the responsibilities that is resting on your shoulders of the 140 crore people in our country, you'll actually know that it's not a piece of cake. So if I was PM for a day, first and foremost, I think most of the day I'll spend time in understanding the kind of power and responsibility that is going to rest on my shoulders and my hands. So Prudentia, we are here uh, announcing the winners and making a small little memory for the winners <laughs> and uh, Dr. Nisha is with us. Uh, I didn't understand uh, how many years it she did she take to do his doctorate, do her doctorate and all the Nisha, one attempt, all clear? Oh, one attempt, <laughs> but that one attempt was five years. <laughs> that I, too from a state uh, university, not a private one. Yeah, my God. Gold medal of MBA uh, and the pre PhD from the state government university. Right. No money, it's only shram. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. So gold winner, gold medal winner, uh, Dr. Nisha. Actually, the reason why we were talking about Nisha so much is because she 
still the pillar behind uh, this Rensha yeah, event to happen so nicely. Of course, her dean uh, also supported uh, Ms. Gunjin Ma'am. She's also supported her a lot. But uh, going ahead with the winners, so one more uh, winner of just a minute. Yeah, in just a minute, the second prize who won the second prize is Yeshwant CS from Presidency University. Super! Yeshwant's video is right here for you. Starting with my topic, e-books versus paper books. Electronic books are good, but uh, I prefer paper books because paper books are the books that you can have it on your hands and you can you can read them uh, ha holding it uh, on your hands in your hands and uh, that's a different experience where you get it from ebooks uh, as far as the pandemic is uh, concerned uh, ebooks are really necessary for us at this time that we cannot buy paper books or we can order them from online but uh, you won't get that experience you know, while you're reading the paper books uh, whereas where you read the ebooks and uh, e books are something uh, that you gain knowledge and it's really important that you uh, uh, put in your effort on reading books uh, to be a daily habit or you have to have the habit uh, of reading books and this is really a life-changing skill that you really uh, have to implement in your life and thank you so much uh, for this uh, wonderful opportunity i really Right, so that was Ashwan's video then and uh, we have also a We third also place. have a third place for just a minute. The person who won third place in just a minute is Akshita SK from Acharya Institute. Fantastic, Akshita from Acharya Institute. There we go, please watch her video. Yes. So my topic is uh, the life without internet. Internet has done a great impact in everybody else, everybody's life. Internet is making things easier. If internet wasn't there in our life, I don't think so the things would be much easier. Now we can just go from one place to another in just a second by seeing the Google map. We can communicate to anybody sitting from the different parts of country just like how we are doing now. But if there was no internet, we couldn't even do this. The life would be difficult according to me. We wouldn't have the much of easiness or the smooth going in life. We had to work really hard and economy would surely come down. I think internet is doing very great to build up the economy and also in the every field of life. It is giving us the uh, great things in all the fields of the life in artificial intelligence or in the communication or in the social media. And it is, make, it is not just making us go down in life, but it is leading us forward and it is telling us things and how to adopt the changes. So I would tell life would, without the internet would be not that easy or more good. So I think internet is doing a great job in everybody else of life and internet was very much required. Thank you. Thank you, Akshita. Thank you very much. So, yeah, so our next participant is Archana S. So this was uh, the winners of uh, two events. We will also continue uh, announcing the winners, but actually it's on the next video because uh, me and uh, Nisha are like a little conservative on the data that goes out because after 10 minutes, the video is not watched, Nisha, mm. actually on YouTube. <laughs> so what we'll do, we'll continue this. See you in the next video to announce the winners.